Hey guys, yours truly, Kevin Grace. I am here in Baltimore. I'm on Pennsylvania Avenue and Lafayette, and behind me is a statue dedicated to a very famous Baltimorean. Even though she wasn't initially born here in Baltimore, she moved uh, as a young child here from Philadelphia. The lady that I'm talking about is named Billie Holiday. She's also named Lady Day. The statue initially was uh, unveiled back in 1985 when William Donald Schaefer was the mayor and in 2009 they added this really nice base and pedestal uh, this is to commemorate her 50th anniversary of her passing uh, she is buried up in New York if you do want to see uh, me pay my respects to her at, at her grave just um, uh, type in Kevin Grace visits the grave of Billy Holiday but uh, this is really nice with this pedestal they talk about a couple of different songs that she did, God Bless the Child, and they have this uh, statue here of a child being pulled out with the umbilical cord, and it has her date of, uh, of when she was born, 1915 and 1959. Unfortunately, she died of uh, basically an overdose of, uh, of heroin. She could, couldn't kick the problem. And uh, another song that she did, Lady Sings the Blues, but yeah, this is a really nice statue and one of her most controversial songs, Strange Fruit, talks about hanging. So as you can see, they have this graphic of a black man being tied to a tree and, and hung. But um, this is a really, really nice statue and this, um, this pedestal is really nice. And see they have a crow here and... Um, and a flower but uh, this is really nice and ironically is facing um, well the remnants of a famous theater in Baltimore called the Royal Theater it was just like the Apollo Theater in New York and the Howard Theater in DC it got knocked down in the um, 80s it had been uh, empty for a long time the area has gotten a little bit bad so um, they wound up knocking it down of course after they knocked it down people were saying they should have kept it up but uh, toward the end, they started using it as a movie theater, and just the area is not that great. But um, just wanted to show you some of the history here in Baltimore that doesn't get talked about. But yeah, this is Billy Holiday. So if you ever do pay your respects, it's on the corner of Pennsylvania Avenue and Lafayette.